also has eight new deaths, and that puts us at more than 6,500. After months of hard work and harvest, an intricate corn maze opened today in Caledonia. Our Jamie Smet gives us a look from above. Liv and Stephen McDaniel have been hard at work in their second year as owners of Deep Roots Produce. This year, they decided to try their hand at something new. We opened a corn maze this year. This is our first year doing it. But their maze has a twist. If you can get a bird's eye view, you can see two dogs carved into the corn maze. And depending on how good you are at mazes, you could be in there for up to two hours um, if you're doing the advanced maze. With mazes ranging from 0.3 miles to nearly two and a half, visitors can choose the length of their journey. The better you are, the faster it'll go, because um, you can get lost in there. But Liv and Steven are making sure there is plenty of fun along the way. There's some platforms in there, so it gets you up above the corn. Um, there's checkpoints along the way. Um, so you can, we have punch cards available. You check off where you're at in the maze and kind of go along and, and win some fun prizes. And when you find your way out of the maze. And we also have produce available and all sorts of goodies, but the, the corn maze is the big thing this fall. And uh, you pick pumpkin patch as well with nine different varieties of pumpkins. Giving families across West Michigan a place to enjoy a peaceful fall afternoon. Stephen says he is thrilled to see these families taking an interest in local farming, especially amongst the little ones. Uh, that's my favorite part about farming. It's a lot of hard work um, from sun up to sundown, always doing something, something different every day. Um, but seeing kids and family members come in and get to learn about agriculture and get excited about it and then actually eat nutritious food that you put your heart and soul in.